Hey everyone, this is Josh from JLAffiliates.com, and today I want to quickly go over advertising pages and selling uh, direct advertising on your website. So, obviously, not every website is a good candidate for um, direct advertising, and when I say direct advertising, I'm talking about simply selling ads on your website, like directly, not you know, not. I'm not talking about adding AdSense to your site or some, you know, affiliate network of, you know, ads or whatever. I mean, directly, you know, selling some certain spot or a link or whatever to a company which advertises their, you know, product or service. Um, so obviously, not every website is going to be a good candidate. You know, your small niche websites, your obscure niches, um, you know, just any website that just doesn't really get a whole lot of traffic um, or is just not in a niche that would have many advertisers not going to be a good candidate but any uh, any website that does have a, a good amount of traffic no matter what the niche is probably in most cases going to be a, a pretty good candidate for that so what you're looking at here is a advertising page on one of my websites this website in particular got hit by Google not long ago and I haven't recovered yet so haven't been ma making many sales um, advertising sales on it lately but for several years uh, three or four years probably more I was actually making several thousand dollars a year now that's not a whole lot but that's just one website I sell ads on other websites too so um, and and another thing is you know it's not a whole lot of money but still you know a few thousand dollars is a few thousand dollars and it's basically for zero work um, all it took was for me to put this advertising page up As soon as I put this advertising page up I started getting emails um, and, and contact form submissions from people wanting to advertise and I actually got some pretty big uh, companies to advertise on my on my site um, a few times so just adding an advertising page to your website can really attract um, companies who want to advertise I mean if you think if you know if you're a even a smaller company I mean I sell ads to small companies too uh, if you're a company that has a product to sell you know almost everyone knows the internet's you know huge now um, a lot of sales are done online so a lot of these companies are going online to find uh, websites to sell their product and they'll just contact you you know they'll, they'll a lot of times they'll find you in Google which is what happened for this site particularly almost all of the advertisers found me from uh, googling uh, the various keywords I rank for in Google and they see well this website ranks well in Google so it obviously gets traffic let's contact them and see if they'll sell us an ad and they do and I sell them an ad um, so just add a, uh, an advertising page that's it that's that's basically all I want to tell you um, if you have any website that gets any decent traffic at all add an advertising page put a link to it somewhere in your site or somewhere noticeable where you know people are going to see it as you can see it's right here advertising you click on that and it brings you to this page um, there's a lot of things you can put on here you can make it basic you can make it complex um, it's kinda up to you it's always a good idea to show proof of your traffic you know what kind of traffic you get tell them about the type of traffic where it comes from you know obviously this is a fairly uh, fairly plain page <clears throat> I could make it a lot better um, definitely uh, people do like to see where the traffic comes from, kind of the demographics. If you can, you know, provide that, you know, what type of, you know, what, what are the people interested in? Where, what websites do they come from, et cetera, et cetera. So, you know, I just put show them the the traffic that I was getting, um, the page rank. I mentioned that, you know, and I tell them, you know, I have affordable um, advertising options, and the goal is just to get them to contact me. They contact me, and then I, you know, accept payment usually via PayPal. Um, and then I put the link up. Um, I sell blocks, you know, three month. I'll sell like a banner for three months or six months or a year. Um, sometimes they'll they'll pay a whole year. A lot of times they'll pay more than a month. Most advertising queries are for advertising for more than a month because most people who are looking to buy advertising spots are a little bit savvy and they know you know a month isn't going to do you a whole lot of good. So they want to you know get a really good solid test so a lot of them will pay um, six months to a year in advance um, and then you know you just offer banners like this one um, links you can sell links obviously that's against Google's terms of service so you want to add a no follow attribute to the link if you do sell those and let and make sure you disclose that uh, let the advertiser know that um, you know banners with the inside the content you know there's all different kinds of options it all depends on your theme and you know and what you're um, willing to offer 
but that's it. Just wanted to let you know. You know, I think it's. I don't think it's really talked about a whole lot in the internet marketing space, selling direct ads. But it it works. I mean, I've done it. I've made thousands and thousands of dollars over the years doing it. it takes very very little work. If you have a website that gets a decent amount of traffic, um, just stick an advertising page. Even if you have a small website that doesn't get a whole lot of traffic, it doesn't hurt. To, you know, to throw an advertising page up to tell them yes we do accept advertising here you know contact us in this way you know give them a phone number if you want or just a contact form or an email just some way for them to contact you and you know you can work out the details from there but it's definitely a good money maker and I don't think it's talked about nearly enough so I hope that helps